Trace Minerals in Our Diet The nine trace minerals, which include iron, zinc, copper, manganese, iodine, fluoride, chromium, and molybdenum, are required by the body in an amount of 100 mg or less per day. The trace minerals are present in the body in an amount of 0.01% or less of body weight. Like the major minerals, trace minerals provide a variety of essential structural and regulatory functions. Some of their roles are unique, for example, fluoride is needed for strong teeth. Iron is required to carry oxygen to body cells. Iodine is needed to make thyroid hormones. Other roles of the trace minerals are similar and complementary, manganese, iron, zinc, copper, selenium are cofactors for antioxidant enzyme systems. The following slides are a brief summary of the nine trace minerals, the sources, the recommended intake for adults, major functions, deficiency diseases and symptoms, groups of people at risk of deficiency, the toxicity, and the tolerable upper intake limit of the trace minerals. Iron. The food sources of iron are whole and enriched grains, dried fruits, leafy greens, and red meats. The recommended intake of iron for adults is 8 to 18 mg daily. The major functions of iron are, iron is needed for the body's immune function. Iron is a part of the electron carriers in the body's electron transport chain. Iron is a part of hemoglobin, which delivers oxygen to cells. Iron is a part of myoglobin, which holds oxygen in muscles. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of iron are, low hemoglobin, small pale red blood cells, fatigue and weakness, iron deficiency anemia. Groups at risk of deficiency of iron are, infants and preschool children, adolescents, women of childbearing age, pregnant women, athletes. The toxicity of iron caused by overconsumption is liver damage and gastrointestinal upset. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of iron is 45 mg daily. Zinc. The food sources of zinc are, whole and enriched grains, eggs, seafood, meat. The recommended intake of zinc for adults is 8 to 11 mg daily. The major functions of zinc are, zinc functions in the human body's growth, development, wound healing, immunity, and antioxidant protection. Zinc regulates protein synthesis. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of zinc are, poor growth and development, skin rashes, decreased immune function. Groups at risk of deficiency of zinc are, elderly, low-income children, and vegetarians. The toxicity of zinc caused by overconsumption is depressed immune functions and decreased copper absorption. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of zinc, is 40 mg daily. Copper. The food sources of copper are, cocoa seafood whole grains nuts seeds organ meat. The recommended intake of copper for adults is 900 micrograms a day. Copper is a part of proteins needed for iron absorption, collagen synthesis, lipid metabolism, nerve and immune function, antioxidant protection. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of copper are, poor growth, bone abnormalities, and anemia. Groups at risk of deficiency of copper are, those who over supplement zinc. The toxicity of copper caused by overconsumption is vomiting. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of copper is 10 mg daily. Fluoride. The sources of fluoride are toothpaste, tea, fish, fluoridated water. The recommended intake of fluoride for adults is 3 to 4 mg a day. The major functions of fluoride are, strengthens tooth enamel, enhances remineralization of tooth enamel, reduces acid production caused by bacteria in the mouth. Symptom caused by the deficiency of fluoride is an increased risk of dental cares, which are soft degraded areas in a tooth. Groups at risk of fluoride deficiency are the populations in areas with unfluoridated water. Toxicity of fluoride caused by over intake are, bone abnormalities, kidney damage, mottled teeth. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of fluoride is 10 mg a day. Iodine. The food sources of iodine are iodized salt, seafood, fish, salt water, dairy products. The recommended intake of iodine for adults is 150 micrograms daily. The primary function of iodine is that iodine is needed to synthesize thyroid hormones. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of iodine are growth and developmental abnormalities, mental retardation, goiter, Cretinism, which is severe hypothyroidism resulting in physical and mental stunning. Groups at risk of deficiency of iodine are, populations in areas with low iodine soil and where iodized salt is not used. The toxicity of iodine caused by overconsumption is enlarged thyroid. 
Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of iodine is 1110 micrograms daily. Manganese. The food sources of manganese are tea, whole grains, legumes, and nuts. Adults adequate intake, AI, of manganese is 1.8 to 2.3 milligrams daily. Manganese functions in the metabolisms of lipid and carbohydrates. Manganese also functions in antioxidant protection for body cells. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of manganese are growth retardation. The toxicity of manganese caused by oversupplement is nerve damage. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of manganese is 11 mg daily. Selenium. The food sources of selenium are whole and enriched grains, eggs, seafood, and organ meats. The recommended intake of selenium for adults is 55 micrograms daily. Selenium functions in synthesizing thyroid hormones, spares vitamin E and protects organ cells from oxidative damage through being a part of glutathione peroxidase. Disease and symptoms caused by the deficiency of selenium are Kashan disease Weakness Muscle pain Groups at risk of deficiency of selenium are The population in areas with low selenium soil Toxicity of selenium caused by overconsumption is hair changes, fatigue, vomiting, diarrhea, nausea. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of selenium is 400 micrograms daily. Chromium. The food sources of chromium are mushrooms, whole grains, nuts, brewer's yeast. The recommended intake of chromium for adults is 25 to 35 micrograms per day. Chromium enhances insulin action and has a role in regulating the blood sugar level. The symptom caused by chromium deficiency is high blood glucose blood sugar level. Groups at risk of deficiency of chromium are malnourished children, children not being provided with adequate nourishment nutrition. There is insufficient data to determine a tolerable upper intake level, UL of chromium, molybdenum. The food sources of molybdenum are legumes, grains, organ meats, and milk. The recommended intake of molybdenum for adults is 45 micrograms a day. Molybdenum is a cofactor for several enzymes. Toxicity of molybdenum caused by overconsumption is arthritis, joint inflammation. Tolerable upper intake level, UL, of molybdenum is 2 mg a day. Sue Tasty made this video. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.